What's good? This might be one of my best day of storage lockers. Stick around till the end. I'll have all the comps for what's sold and then what is expected to be sold. I'm only 14 days in, so this is an incredible results already and lots of money to be made. What's good? I bought two more storage lockers this week. If you're just joining, my name is Carl. I'm a registered dietitian, a part-time reseller. Like I use this channel to document my reselling stuff. I take things from abandoned storage lockers, flip them on, on eBay mostly, some Facebook marketplace. Um, and this week I bought two relatively small units. See if I can fit it in the car. Should be two trips. It would be a miracle if I could fit it in one. Um, I'll summarize the total cost at the end. It's just under $300. I was watching five. This is a huge, huge facility. There's about 15 for, um, for auction today and uh, kind of ranked my top five. And uh, the first one went for way too much money because there was a lot of visible value in there and I got my second and third choice for pretty good, pretty good price. So let's see what's inside. much the second shoe better be in here though what's it called valley switzerland definitely seeing sweet jersey is that chivas i thought i i don't even know what that is hopefully some good branded stuff but really just bought it hoping that shoe's in there Alright, first suitcase. Got some new tag stuff. 35 bucks for those. I don't know what the heck those are. Some frills. Jersey. This one has tag. Rag and bone. Clearance. $80 from Nordstrom. That's wild. I'll figure out how I list those. Probably used, but highlight the fact that they have tags because they're a little rough around the edges. But this might be some of the. Best branded clothes. This is what H&M, 35. Sweet, good stuff so far. All right, two suitcases down. This little bag, this is like velour or velvet. Not velvet, but I don't know, men's suit coat. And then, found them. Not a lot I've sold, but they're like $200 new, so. There we go. This will get my money back alone. I'm only in for 30 bucks on this, but I don't know what some of these are. Fila, Vans, Puma, New Balance, Nike. Boom. Maybe I don't need that. That extra one. Suitcase number three. Just a lot of new attack stuff. This is gonna be very interesting. Do a lot of $4.99, $9.99 eBay auctions to vault, get rid of this volume. Oh, that's not a good sign. That might be why it's new with tag. These suitcases alone are worth 30 bucks. Just saw these real quick. I'm a lot bit skeptical though. Versace collection. I've not dealt with the Versace other than jeans before. The tongue, you can't see it there, it says made in Bangladesh, so research needed. First one is done. Loading up the car. Gonna open the second one, fill up the car, and probably come back tomorrow for a second trip. I got more work to do at home to do other stuff, but it's a nice little break. What's behind door number two? Books, clothes, bike. And the Jordans. Probably overpaid, but we'll see. They're pretty clean. Two, three. Hell if I know. I just don't know my Jordans. I can look them up. Alright. This should be pretty quick, actually. I might be able to fit this in the car. It's actually funny. I thought I'd seen some LRG in the other locker, which made me more inclined to buy it, but LRG was actually in this locker. Some toys. Jordans are sweet. This is a whole train set. I don't know the brand. Moda. Could be some money. We'll see. Some muffler. Christmas tree stand. A 
keep digging here. Alright. Everyone knows those colors. I can't even tell in the dark, but... Gonna have to do some research on this one, too. Alright, this one's getting interesting. That is... I guess a windshield from Harley. That is a seat for Harley. This is probably a cover for a Harley, which makes that probably parts for a Harley. All right, I think this is gonna fill the car. And I was just digging through the last bag that I haven't really looked at, because I'm gonna come back for this in the morning. And some Air Maxes. So what, more Air Maxes? Flight. Something. Sweet. All right, this is just a quick preview of about half of the stuff sorted out so far. Um, so that's just trash there. I'm not gonna show you these shoes yet. Those are just trash shoes. Um, I still need to do some homework on this muffler. I think it's for the Harley. This is a Harley cover, so that should bring some money. The saddle or the seat, whatever you call it, for the Harley. If it cleans up, might be 50 to 75 bucks. Um, Galaxy S7 Edge. I didn't bother looking it up, but it's going to be for parts because it's cracked. This might be a power bank, I'm not sure, but probably not worth much. Mark Jacobs wallet. Um, two gift cards to check. Um, some Alex and Annie jewelry. This looks like a power charger for something. Uh, again, just do some homework. A brawn, I think, toothbrush charger. Um, these are all bags, so a hat. I don't know if there's a name on there. This is a Nike, like, toiletry bag. I'm pretty sure this is fake Louis, but setting it aside just in case. Um, I don't think there's a name brand on there, but I thought that was cool. Put that up. Um, there's a name somewhere on here, but I'm not sure. That's probably going to get donated. This is the Gucci bag that... We'll see if this checks out. I'm hopeful for it, but with anything name brand, I don't get too excited anymore because everything's so fake. Um, this needs to be cleaned up like heck, but it's Coach and it's older, I think. Usually Coach doesn't do so great, but it's worth trying. All of that's like athletic um, clothes. This is all like Victoria's Secret athletic and outdoor stuff. Um, and then that one is also clothes and a ton of Levi jeans. Um, that we've got is donate clothes trash and I've finally emptied out the first batch of shoes so here is a hell of a preview of the shoes um, I'll do a quick walk through. I haven't comped any of these yet um, I recognize some high-end brands but again skeptical until I check out is real um, Caesar Jordan 2 retro those are those were open so I bought the locker base on that um, Air Maxes flights foam posits um, these are Adidas. These, I bought one of the other lockers. So, this came out of one locker and these came out of the other. Um, all the name brand ones, not Nike, came out of this locker. So these are Bali, Switzerland. Um, new, these are like 200 or 150. Um, with these New Balance. These claim to be Valentino. I have sold Valentino sandals before for like $150. This claims that the price was $1,250 original on sale for $360. Um, they're cool, feel legit, we'll see. Do some homework, um, some more Nike. We got like Iris and LeBron's, Reeboks, more Nike, Nike, some Pumas, some Vans. The Fila, I'm looking for the other, um, the left shoe for both of them, or yeah, and then whatever that is, I don't have a pair for, and whatever that is, I don't have a pair for yet, hopeful. These are Ralph Lauren, more Nike, and then more home runs, so these claim to be Saks Fifth Avenue, and these have a $100 price tag on them, like studded sandals, and these claim to be Ferragamo, which if these check out, should be quite a bit of money. I've heard the name, I just don't know what the 
what the dollar amount looks like on Ferragamo. So, um, and this is just like Zara or something. I'll put that in the last shoe category. So, uh, might be the best shoe haul ever. I'll uh, check back with whatever I find next. All right, I made it through two of the three suitcases. I got one suitcase full of new tag clothes. This one was mostly donate, and you can see the mouse droppings there. Uh, it was one of the, like, uh, what do you call those? Like exercise pants. Um, so, a bunch of hats here. I think those from yet yeah, Russian culture, Adidas with the sticker, American Supply, another Adidas, Russell, Jordan, oops, sorry, Jordan DC, uh, Tiger Club, that's Boy Scouts, I think. That looks like, was it Hardy or whatever? Nope, San Diego Hat Company. Okay. DC, Trump, come out and party, free something, Tommy Hilfiger, and probably H&M, yep, H&M, alright, interesting, forgot I had the other half of the suitcase, and there's the rest of the fila, oh, got some dirt on it, oh, damn, now it's got to something, hopefully not the shoes, the only other orphan shoe so I'll dig through the rest of this might have some electronics oh boy more shoes yes now remember always keep your burger buns and honey inside your suitcase inside of a nice champion bag for rats to get through ironically I'm gonna see if I can still sell this <laughs> New with tags just keeps piling up. Michael Kors with tags, Diesel with tags, and Denim with tags, Zara with tags. Unreal. There's like good selling stuff mixed in, of course. Um, I'm guessing this is now getting into the weed stuff, but literal weed. There's already one bong. Oh, that's not. Maybe not. Just a false alarm. But um, these say Dior on them. I have not checked these ones yet. These say, I'm gonna have to check these inside. These say Armani on them. These say Fendi on them. These say Kenzo. This is potentially a home run, but again, I, Prada. I am crazy skeptical, especially of these sunglasses. Um, even one of them is real. This is insane. All right, it's getting late and final walkthrough. I'm gonna check out the books tomorrow. Um, no orphan shoes anymore. Everything's got a pair. And found an extra two pairs of Fila. Donate, donate. Suitcase and a half of keep. Wash, wash, and then a bag of bags with the Gucci bag, and then. I'm going to leave the Harley stuff uh, here till tomorrow. Alright, I'm calling it a night on um, first night. I've listed all of the Nikes. This is 13 pairs for $1,212. Most expensive ones are Tim Duncan foam posits. Um, these apparently are more collectible and rare. I have them listed for astronomical amount like 370 or something realistically it looks closer to one or 150 but there's so few listed and the comps there are some anomalies that went for three four hundred so why not uh, a lot of these are right around a hundred but likely if it takes a while I'll take off or slower um, those I'll probably just wear for a while and then eventually donate because they're not worth much these are listed, but they're not Nike, they're Uggs. And then those have been rejected for the day. Um, all the Fila, I guess, are under 20 buck comps. The um, New Balance, ironically, I actually just listed a pair of these this morning. Um, they're just missing the insole. So um, 
20 bucks with the insole. I'll probably just donate them. And then H&M, they're basically lightly used, barely, barely, but um, I can't identify item numbers on H&M. So clearing out the rest of it tomorrow morning and uh, definitely should have my money back here in no time. Loading up day two, should be pretty quick. All clear. Time to head home. Alright, unloaded the car. Got the Harley stuff all piled there. I'm going to take care of that probably this weekend. Half of it hopefully I can eBay. I don't know if there's any resale on the exhaust stuff, but hopefully. Um, this is going to donate. This is going to donate. I haven't looked up the shoulder pads, but probably donate. This will take five minutes to sort through. That's all probably trash. It looks pretty soiled. Um, well, it says donate. Dig through this bag real quick. That's trash. And then real quick, I'm going to get through all these books. I'm going to go grab my other phone that I use for scanning. But I'm thinking 20 minutes I can get through these. A lot of them may end up getting tossed because you can see right here, like there's some that are crazy soiled. I don't even know if you can see there. But water damage and stuff like that. So... I'm gonna guess maybe five to ten books out of this. I'll actually be willing to sell, so we'll see. All right, 25 minutes all it took. Everything here over is getting donated. I was really hoping that Tupac book was gonna be worth something. Um, those are just molded out, so those are getting trashed. Um, Harry Tubman's going on my bookshelf, and then here is the for sale stack. So one, two. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 books for sale, um, probably about $150, this one was like 20 this one was about 15 um, Huey Newton was like 15 um, if you ever find this one, it's worth looking up, so this is like one of the top 10 books <laughs> on Amazon, um, so it sells within seconds just about. Um, this one surprisingly was like 20 bucks. Some of these are only like three or five bucks, but overall pretty good. I might do another separate video another time on how quick these are to scan. So all these books, 25 minutes and about 150 bucks.